170 pounds with a record of one win and two losses. Fighting out of Powell MMA from Cincinnati, Ohio, it's Derek Mielenkamp. And across the cage, weighing 168 pounds with a record of one win and two losses. Fighting out of Vision MMA from Cincinnati, Ohio, it's George Nichols. Fellas, B2 fight fans, when this fight gets started, coming out of the blue corner and black trunks, Derek Mellencamp. Coming out of the red corner and black trunks, He's George South Nichols. Pod Orthodox. Yeah, here we go. Ooh, coming out strong, both of them. Throwing with intentions. Nice leg kick. Mr. Mellencamp there has that jab working for him real well. Coming out, starts sticking that jab right off the bat. Nice leg kick. Trading leg kicks Trading. back and forth. I love it. Nice check. Good. Body kick, good. Body kick. That's fun to see as the fight goes on how, how they adapt to one another. Yeah, exactly. They go in there, they're using their hands, they're using their feet, they're, they're figuring out who wants to pressure, who doesn't. Yeah, I mean, I, I agree with his corner. I agree with Derek's corner. Keep the jab going, man. Both of them very kick heavy, kick first type fighters. Ooh, nice oh, check to kick. Oh, nice right there. And as of now, it doesn't look like anyone wants to take down. They want to go out there and prove how good they are standing. Wild overhand punch. If it would have landed, it would have, would have been a finishing it blow. It would have been a finishing blow for sure. It had bad intentions. Nice. Cartwheel kick. They, they did a cartwheel. Hey. Yeah. Okay. And it kind of landed. It did. <laughs> it did. There's, there's contact. I want to see it again. Slow motion. Filling each other out. Looks like Derek Snow's bleeding a little bit to the right side. He got cartwheeled kicked to the <laughs> face. <laughs> The toe, the big toe, yeah. skin the nose. Oh, big right hand. Good, they're in there. Uh, Mr. Milton can't be, he's being a bully in there, which is, which is fun this to is watch. A, yeah, it is. It, 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 gotta see if George can figure out how to, oh. holy hell. That was slick, man. George Nichols is pulling crap out of his rear end like crap. I mean, I've never seen that before. Yeah. What do they call that, a tornado kick? A tornado kick. Oh, he just made contact with that big overhand right. And you know what, all this fancy stuff he's doing is starting to make Mr. Mellencamp come forward a little less, throw a little less. Well, now he's got to respect it. He's, I mean, yeah. he's got to. I don't know how to defend it, so I can't imagine he does <laughs> either. Right. Hands up and hope he doesn't hit the liver. Ten seconds left. Oh. There we go, coming out with the big kick right off the yeah. bat, trying to keep, keep uh, Mr. Mellencamp from coming forward too much. He's reading the kicks, checking some stuff. Oh, nice right. Yeah, following up that yeah. kick. Nice check. Beautiful check. Yeah, throw that jab out more. It needs to throw the jab out even more. Nice leg kick. So if I kick and you check, I'm not going to kick anymore. Right. Oh, big oh, right hand. Oh, big contact there. George, George is composed. He's staying calm. I just feel like Mellicant just needs to go in. I like to see more output from George, too. George has let Mellicant dictate the pace of this fight. He's, he's been on his back foot the whole time. Yeah, he has been. Uh, he, he's been allowing Mellencamp to bully him a little bit. Yeah, 100%. I'd like to see him push him back and just little things to change it. Get get a few more kicks, add a couple jabs. And then he'll explode with some crazy tornado kick. Yeah. Or, you know, whatever. Cartwheel. 
Ooh, he barely missed that overhand, uh, overhand left. But he just needs to set it up. If he would just set it up, he could land these. I want him to start chanting tornado kick, tornado kick. I want to see more. Good jab, good jab. Beautiful jab. He's got a great jab. He just doesn't throw it enough. Nice little combination for George. George is, he's just, he's not, he's not pulling the trigger, man. Yeah, he, he's got to start doing something a little bit. Because uh, you, you can see uh, uh, Mellencamp, he, he's pushing forwards more again like he did at the beginning of round one. He's starting to throw more. He's starting to get a little, little fancy. So flying knee backflip might might all help. Nice little bump check right there by George Nichols. But you know, when somebody's real kick heavy, like throwing kicks out, they're nervous to use their hands. They're yeah. nervous to engage to get hit. They, George yes. Nichols don't want to get hit. That's the problem. It's a good hesitation to have. No, it's great, yeah. but it's losing him the fight because yes. there's no output. Yes, it is. And he's having success when he throws. He's got good timing with it. He's found that right. range. He's just got to get a little more confident with it. Big right hand. Okay, neither one will. Oh, there's the first step forward, first step back is. Meeting in the middle of the ring. There we go. A little flying something. Yeah. Ooh, he's going to cry to get him. I mean, George, good checks. I mean, George has great checks, man. Yeah, he's <laughs> reading a lot. I just want him to, to stop reading and start writing. That's all right. He's just, no, he can't pull the trigger. I like that, reading and writing. I just made that up right now. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to use that. Reading him what? Re re he needs to stop reading everything and start writing it. There you go. Yeah. Y'all listened at home. Sam Elby said that first. <laughs> that was an original. It was. It's going on. <laughs> I'm very proud of myself for coming up with that. <laughs> George is not fit, fighting like he wants to finish this. No, he does. He's got to start attacking that he, head or throwing a lot more kicks. He doesn't want to. He doesn't want to engage, man, at all. He does not want it to engage. I don't get it. That's what I'm saying. If, if I'm Mellencamp, I'm going for broke, man. I'm going to be aggressive and moving forward, hard punches. And I just don't think George wants to be in there. Do a Showtime kick off the cage. He could probably do I suspect he can do it. He seems pretty uh, athletic and dynamic. Oh, he could definitely do it, for sure. He's got to do something. I mean, it really, Mellicamp hasn't been throwing nothing this third round. Really. He's, he, they've just been sitting there fighting at each other. Oh, that's a nice jab right there. That was there. a good that's jab, forcing him back a little. Ooh, question mark kick coming up top. Set it up a little bit, throw that jab and then question mark. I think George is reacting to his corners a little oh, more too. Right here, yeah. They're pounding on the cage and every time they pound, he, George is doing something, throwing something. Uh, Mr. Mellencamp seems to be enjoying this fight. He, he's loving this. Oh, he's having fun. Man. Yeah, he's, he's in there. He's trying to read everything. He's got his jab going. He's got his swagger moving. He's had to worry about two overhand rights. That's it. And a jab. Nice, see? Nice little escape there. I want to see the escape and then attack. Boom. There we go. There's a big overhand. Oh, oh good. That almost kicked. That's that, the thing. George has the tools, man. He Your winner by unanimous decision, 30-27, out of the blue corner, Derek Millencamp.